Hello and welcome back. In this short lecture, we're going to learn about how to configure Android Enterprise specific profile, which is a custom specific, uh, which is nothing but OMA and uh, URI settings. Uh, let's say example, if you want to apply some kind of settings which are not available uh, within the default uh, Intune profiles, but you wanted to restrict such kind of uh, specific settings, then this custom specific uh, settings can be applied. Let's uh, create how to create that. Let's go back to Microsoft Intune and then click on device configuration, click on profile and create a profile. And uh, here you can choose as a platform as uh, Android Enterprise, and choose here custom as a profile type give a meaning name like I'm gonna uh, take as example as a copy paste giving the example as a description here like I'm gonna enter here as a, a blocking copy paste between your work profile as well as the uh, personal apps uh, so now here if you can see here the platform type is my uh, Android enterprise and the profile type is custom so within the custom you have an options to configure here uh, OMEA or URI settings. So when I click on add, it's going to ask for three, four uh, different uh, values to be you know, entered here. Like you can give the uh, name. So I'm just going to give here as a name as a, I'm entering as a block, copy and paste. And the description as I earlier given, the same description I'm going to give here. And uh, this is where the key thing like uh, OME or URI, that specific value. So in my case, I'm just entering OME URI specific value. Uh, this is the like Winder, MSFT, and work profile, Dizello, cross profile, copy, paste. So this is the value which I'm gonna configure. Now here in the data type, I'm going to choose, choosing as this value is specific to Boolean. So I'm just choosing here the Boolean, and this value is going to be whether true or false. So in my case, if I choose as true, it's gonna uh, not gonna allow that specific setting. For other OME or URI specific settings, there are only three different values that can be used here. If you can look at here, one would be the SSID that is Wi-Fi specific and packages specific. Other one would be the cross profile type. And remaining any of the settings, if you wanna apply uh, the specific settings, you may have to configure, uh, not from the custom, but you should be configuring from OEM config, uh, which is, uh, another option within the Intune. If you can look at, so far we have touched all these, but not the OEM config. So within the OEM config, what you will be doing is you would be contacting the OEM operator uh, or the principal company uh, to get such kind of you know, specific settings. And uh, that would uh, configure uh, the additional values which are not covered by under custom. So these customs are nothing but your uh, Intune supported values and uh, the OEM is specific to uh, the vendor specific settings which that specific vendor can provide you or if somebody is developed that kind of you know configuration then you can use that specific OEM specific configuration so mostly it would be the XML format or JSON format and that values you can uh, use them as a tease. As a next step I'm gonna click OK and uh, that would be Okay, and this policy gets created. Post to that, I can assign for the required uh, AD group. In this case, for example, if I want to assign for my all finance users, I can choose that, hey, I wanted to assign for the finance users. So just go to the assignments and click on the specific groups and then you can assign that specific group. And if you want to exclude, you can always exclude by selecting that specific group and click on save. That way it's gonna save this specific policy. Thank you for watching this.